completely different matter. And if you look at this from a literary standpoint, you know, good luck. Maybe you'll, you'll get a Harry Potter, but probably not. <laughs> but if you look at this from a business standpoint, then it's a very different thing entirely, and it probably will increase your odds of being able to, to get a book deal. Mm -hmm. And the other thing is, is too many bloggers will, and, and this is especially true, I think, in the lifestyle design niche, a lot of the blogs, they talk a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. When I started my trip and I was saying, yeah, I am going around the world, well, who cares, right? Anyone can say they're going around the world. But once I was doing it for several years and I said, yes, I've been doing this for several years and I actually have some experience and authority and I did it then it, it changes your story completely, right? Mm -hmm. You're not just someone who talks about it, who talks the talk. I walked the walk. I did it, right? Yeah, yeah. I've been to all these countries. I've been doing this for three years. I live out of a freaking bag. I don't have a house. Um, and that changes the story and how people perceive you. And if you have something, you know, if you're trying to build a blog, you're trying to build an audience, do something. <laughs> I mean, do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You can talk about, yeah, I want to do this. I want to, you know, be location. Okay, that's fine. Great goal. Um, but until you actually start doing something and achieve some credibility and authority having actually achieved it, I don't, it's going to be very difficult to build an audience. Yeah. Right? I mean, just think of yourself, right? You've been in Thailand how long now? Um, you're a little over a year and a half. Yeah, okay. So that's a big difference from before you went there, right? Yeah, yeah. In terms of what you know and and just perception, right? Yeah, I've been doing this. I've been I've working here, living in, you know, overseas for a year and a half now is a big difference from well, I'm going to do it. Yeah. And walking the walk is in many parts it's more important than talking the talk. Yeah. Especially I think in in travel because a lot of people travel, a lot of people go on gap year trips, a lot of people travel around the world. Uh, but I think you need to have something in your portfolio where people kind of take you a little bit more seriously or give you a little bit more credibility. Yeah. And I think that's true in any niche that you're in, but especially true in travel. Yeah. Well, yeah, so you told me like ages ago, we were talking about blog posts like these, and I know that you wanted to rip the lifestyle design niche a new one, so, but yeah, I mean, keep, you know, tell me more about your thoughts on that. Yeah, I mean, you can talk about success in the abstract sense, right? That's only good for so far. Mm -hmm. After a point, that's, that's strategy. That's not even strategy, that's a goal, right? I'm going to be successful and live overseas, and that's just all this meta, fluffy cloud stuff. <laughs> At a certain point, the things which are truly valuable are the tactical things. Mm -hmm. This is how you go about living overseas. This is how 